everybody and um, nice to see you. Well, nice for you to see me. Um, today we're going to do Sunhouse Death Letter Blues. Great song, a great tune for working on the streets. In fact, now is a good time for me to explain something and that is that everything I put up are all my own arrangements. Uh, I'm making no pretenses uh, to say that I'm doing a a perfect reproduction of the originals because that's not what I do. Um, what I do is, you know, I play these things on the streets and I earn money and what I'm sharing with you is how I do it and um, if that helps then super. I'm, I'm not saying, you know, I'm, I'm brilliant, I'm the world's best, uh, you've got to do it this way. This is how I do it and and hopefully it'll help. Can I let this the introduction good place to start really a um, couple of things to remember about this song it's all about the fun nearly every other note is going to be if in doubt hit the bass string um, and we're in G G D G so fret remember we're using a slide so you don't want to put your, your uh, finger behind the fret which you would with uh, you know with another guitar if you weren't using a slide it's got to be the slide right over the fret <laughs> Um, with the top G. So in, in other words, it's um, the open G followed by the third fret, followed by open G, followed by the third fret, followed by open G. And then right up to the 12th fret. Counted out, well, you don't really need to, you know, you'll hear it. Now, last note on the last time we do it, just come down and hit the seven, eight, ten. Sunhouse. You know, um, I can't wait. I'm going to do a film about Sunhouse um, 
and really his guitar playing was spectacular. He used to hold his fret, you know, like his, um, his slide like that, a little angle and... So don't worry about getting things perfect when you're playing street blues. And especially with one of these instruments. The whole idea is to be authentic, to bash it out. Yeah, so that is the first lot of four bars. your G and now we're going to go to the C chord which is the fifth fret because remember we're playing in open G so I, I, I've chosen this song part of the reason I chose this song is because it fits so well into the previous two so yeah you get the idea so you can excuse me you're going to slide up to the fifth fret. Yep. So let's go from the top. the C chord, yeah, the C chord. Yeah, so I go down to the third fret and then slide back up again. Pause, pause, hold it. Then you're back into the same um, rift which we used at the very beginning. So let's play the whole thing right up to that point slowly. which is the seventh fret. So it's very, very simple stuff. A basic blues progression, G, going into the C, going back to the G, going up to the D, and then going back to the G for the turnaround. So... <laughs> introduction. 